Hey yo guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel guys. It's your boy Ragnar. You know what it is, boys verified, you know. Uh if you're new to the channel, would you like and subscribe? And yeah, let's get right into the video. So today I'm not gonna do no top 10 video or you know, I'm we do no prediction video, you know, like the biggest uh event in our server right now, the snow cup. Like I was just checking out the squad finals and I like saw these teams, you know, they play their heart out, and I'm just guessing and you know wondering which teams are gonna make it to the to the finals. So we got 24 teams with me today. I'm gonna do an analysis. I'm making my own predictions on which teams you think gonna be to the final. So uh let me know in the comment section which teams you think are gonna make it to the final. There are a lot of newcomers, you know, a lot of um heavy heaters, your your standard teams that are you know always doing the most in the tournament, and a couple of newcomers, actually quite surprising faces that are doing the most. So uh we're gonna look at the analysis of the gameplay from the quarterfinals. And as you all know, finals is happening tomorrow on the 20th of May 2022 live on Omega Snow Channel. And yeah, so let me know what you think in the comment section. So we're gonna analyze the first teams, which is Excess. Um, I mean Excess is quite a good team. Like, you know, they've got like a lot of heavy teams. As you can see, Excess Crazy Archer doing the most with his VSS. Um, do they have the potential to make it to the final though? Do you think they can make it to the final? Like, I mean uh it's quite tricky but maybe just maybe they could make it to the final because we can see them doing the most you know clearing squad all side here with a snipe but uh if you know i mean finals are comprised of 12 teams so out of 24 teams here today 12 teams will be going home and 12 teams will be going to the final with ss uh, look like look at this guy bro clearing squad on his own almost doing a squad wipe uh okay the yakuza are running away from the fight because they're scared but do you think excess is capable of making it to the final um i think so so uh right now i'll say they're number 12. so maybe so definitely one of my team making it to the final is excess as excess crazy is taking an old gravity here it's quite amazing and then number two coming up would be oh wait that's okay actually excess is still in the fight so let's see this is the third game where they secured the uh, point to get to the semi-final which is happening tomorrow so do you think they can make it to the final you know with such accuracy like this from x is crazy the man has been phenomenal we saw in the first couple of games how he took out a uh, whole old gravity squad all by himself insane accuracy right there so definitely i think they can make it to the final and we have opw like this is a this is everyone's favorite right? like we all know opw in tournaments they always represent they always like there's no tournaments that opw do not at least get a couple of boys we can see opw tripper they're taking out a uh, omega squad though that's snap of course that's snap i mean like snap is probably the best i wouldn't say the best player in the server right now but definitely if i'm to make a top 10 best player in the server right now again snap is definitely getting to the top five you know what i'm saying so opw definitely uh i think they close two boys in this in this tournament uh, in the quarterfinal and definitely opw boy um opw definitely have a spots in the in the quarterfinals in the finals i mean you know and maybe they might win it but we're not sure because like i said there are a lot of newcomers heavy hitters in the tournament so we have two people sitting on the seat right now for the finals which is excess and opw as you can see these guys are relentless they always do the most they make sure like if you go back to my previous video where i did a top uh was the top five or top 10 esports players esports players you can see opw snap coming up there which means like this guy is definitely dedicated and soon like i've been saying soon we're gonna have our own official tournament in ssa and then when that tournament happens best believe to see a lot of a whole lot of action from opw because they just that good this is a good dedicated just for esports tournament and coming up as you can see they're still wiping the squads they're quite good you know opw snap leading such, leading such a heavy army is not amazing so if we ever happen to make it to free fire world cup or a free fire world series best believe a player from opw is gonna be you know rapping ssa in that tournament and number three we have og oh gravity like hey man uh i'm not trying to become without no confirmation bias because as you all know i left fbi and i'm currently in all gravity this is actually another uh a very very good you know esports queue they're quite good in the cs action uh open map they always represent you know they've won master they've won the uh, two-face master league here and there 
and some couple of other major tournaments. And definitely, I do believe, you know, they have a they have a spot in the finals because you can see, you know, OG being doing the things like these guys are good, eh? Like these guys are pretty good, you know, like. When I was considering which guilds to join, I kind of chose OPW and o, o Gravity. And we have Don Panic. We don't have really much on them, you know. But um, let's see what they can do. Let, 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 let's see what they can do, you know. But I don't really think Don Panic is capable of, you know, making it to the final. I mean, they probably got lucky on their way here, but in terms of final, no. And of course, another crowd favorite, Gun Smokers. Gun Smokers. Like, this guild is just it's a it's a power pack guild you know with um uh gs Ru, like you all know rolani teamed up with snap and a couple of other heavy hitters in ssa and won the hundred thousand rent tournament last year of metal states and like i'm saying if there's a pro league or an official league in ssa which you're gonna have soon best believe gun smokers are gonna be one of the head like one of the you know, main guild representing and if and not even if when we go to as I say, um, I'm Free Fire World Series or Free Fire World Cup in the nearest future, which I believe you're gonna be. I know Gunsmokers are gonna be there rapping as I say, like these guys are relentless. Just saw them take out the whole squad of Ice Slam. Is it Ice Slam or Slam Eyes, you know? But you know what it, it is, what it is. And you see them here, you know, always fighting, always looking for the kill. And if you watch closely in this game, Ru came up with 11 kills. How can one man get 11 kills in a tournament? It's insane, guys. It's really, really insane. So, uh, yeah, so definitely uh, Gunsmokers have a place in the final. So that's four teams so far. You know, out of 24 teams, 12 teams are going to the final. Eight more spots left. Who do you guys think are going to make it to the final? Uh, if you look at the description, you're going to see the list of names of the guild that are playing the summer finals tomorrow are going to be in the final. Make your predictions and just maybe you can win yourself a little something. As you all know, Snow's tournament is being powered by Acer Nitro on, on the um, summer yeah, final. She gave a little bit of giveaway, a 150 rent gift card. So just stay tuned, keep your eyes open in the comment section. Uh, glue to the tournament as well. And just maybe we can win yourself something. You can see Ru always doing the Ru things, you know, making the most. You know, look at him. This is a pro tournament player. And uh, if you would look at my top 10 best players in SSA and the top 10 esports player in SSA, this man is definitely on the list he represents. He's, his build is such an amazing guild like it's it's a war guild it's a power pack guild you know dedicated to esports tournaments and major tournaments as well they won a couple of mastermind tournaments and a whole lot of other important tournaments as well like they do not let their opponent get away if you happen to jump gun smokers in a tournament my guy i'm sorry like i'm really sorry if you if you're not as strong as opening w or a very very strong team you are losing points you are dying immediately you can see Ru wiping out the whole of is a serenity. I think that's serenity, if I'm not mistaken. Like relentless. Uh Ru is trying to chase the last person. Like you do not let anyone get away. Every kill is important. Every kill they consider. This is the man who led the you know the uh dream crushers to win the hundred thousand rent tournament we had. And yeah, so we have GS Ru from Gunsmokers leading his team to the final, which I know. And just maybe Gunsmokers have a uh, strong possibility of winning the final, but it's gonna be a power packed one. And uh, number five, we have four brothers. You know, like I haven't really seen this good perform much. It's quite a, like a, a new good, but they're actually like, you know, showing some a whole lot of heart here. You know, they're doing the most strategic in their placements, not taking any chances, not leaving anything to chance either. Look at Madara here, strategically waiting for his bait in his opening. So with this kind of strategy, they just might end up in the final but we never know look at that look at it guys like yo this is just this is just another well strategic glue dude if you ask me like they are playing together on like gun smokers if you notice gun smokers play the other like you know always hunting for the kill but this dude they stick together right to the end you know fight us as a team uh i'm not quite sure if they can place it in the final like i said a whole lot of newcomers and heavy hitters in the building but with eight spots to go uh, I'd say um, four brothers might be on the waiting list to enter the finals, but you know anything can happen because a whole lot of surprises was, you know, uh, happening in this tournament. Like some heavy guild, like your Lost Army, which we thought would be there, but they couldn't make it. But yeah, so like I said, I'll reserve my yes or no as to them being taken to the finals. But definitely, they do have a strong potential to make it to the final. Like. Their teamwork is insane, guys. They're always sticking together. This is what we need from Jude trying to participate in esports tournaments or trying to make a name for themselves. I mean, 
with 60,000 diamonds on the line. That's a lot of diamonds. Like, if you actually to convert it to rands, it's almost, you know, 12,000, 13,000 rand. That's a lot of money, you know. And this money is going to be won next this weekend. This week, um, next weekend after the uh, summer final determines who good, which guys are going to the final. And they just relentless. The teamwork is amazing. As you can see, they're always sticking together, leaving nothing to chance. Like, strategically playing. Like, you know, they just took out a whole, a whole almighty GS. It's been taken about four brothers. It's insane. Like, it's insane. It's just crazy. Now, look at, you can see. You can see it with the, yo, man, this guy is wrecking those glow walls. He's leaving nothing to chance. Man, make sure they confirm that kill. You can see Madara here earlier. Look at uh, four brothers goats strategically flanking their opponent just to make sure they do not get away. Like, this is a dude that has a heavy potential on making it to the final, you know. As you can see there, uh, four big goats is flanking and he's got a beautiful position right here. Look at him taking out GS. Look at it. Madara taking out GS and then he's still instinctively shooting down the whole of GS squad. Will Rook get away? Uh, okay, just got away there. And then we have a newcomer called Serenity. Like, these guys are just, you know, amazing. Actually, it's beautiful to watch this guy play. And then we can see here, like, Serenity got almighty Gunsmoker squad again. Would it make it to the finals though? Like these are like a newcomer, like no one knew about yesterday. Like this guy's glow wall is amazing. Striker, can, can, as you can see, he's quite an experienced player, you know. And then there we go, Striker with the, you know, squad wipe for his team. With this kind of play and, you know, Downy, they just might make it to the finals. They just might. And we have Ice Slam here in this game. Uh, Gunsmoker particular wipe Ice Slam. Earlier in this game, I can see they run away. And then look at him, Ice Gojo. Look at that. Beautiful headshot from him. Look at that. Double headshot. This is a team that I believe has got a strong potential of making it to the final. They just might make it to the final because, I mean, I've slam. Slam Ice, Ice Slam, whatever the guild is called. With a whole lot of controversial going around the guild lately. I mean, this is a very, very good start to you know. Get a clean slate or, you know, get their name back. And there's Ragnar with a double snap. I mean, uh, if you know Ragnar's story, he's a very, very good, interesting no player who actually specializes in sniper and tournaments. You know, but I mean, like, that's a very, very essential gun to have. With a one snap on the tournament and then nice long ranges and two short ranges, definitely you guarantee the booyah. And I'm showing this game, I think they did booyah the game if I'm not mistaken. But as we can see here, they definitely trying to wipe four brothers out and four brothers is down. Look at that. Teamwork, always sticking together. With Slam Ryan, headshotting four brothers. And there we go. With the, uh, at, yeah, this is the game they won. Uh, this is offline, rushing uh, Slam Ice. And then, of course, they are very, very good in long range and short range fights. And there's Ragnar. There's Ice Gojo with a beautiful headshot earlier. And boom, with a double, imagine a close range double snapper shot. That's insane, guys. This is a guild that I believe actually has gotten the number five spots. And in their place, and look at that with a beautiful squad wipe. Look at that with a beautiful snap. So definitely, in my predictions, I believe I slam or slam eyes are making to the final. Let me guys know in the comment section what you guys think. And then on number uh, seven, we have new Genesis. You know, this squad is strong, dude, but I, I feel like they're kind of more strong in our clay squad. With a low yeah, effort on open rank, uh, I wouldn't say they well. quite, you know, heavy yeah. on esports, open or open well. map rather. But yeah. uh, Clash Squad, <laughs> they're very, very good. You know, New Genesis yeah, and apparently NG Boss did the so um, <laughs> uh, New Genesis and then yeah. join uh, nice Gunsmokers. But that, either way, yeah. New Genesis is strong. And then we have Red. I didn't see I much of action from Red, you know, considering it's quite, okay <laughs> it's quite an okay guild. It's quite an okay guild. And I believe I, I'm yeah, like, now I'm still going to put me in on probation. Out. I don't know if they'll make it to the oh, finals yeah, or not. But then, you know, like I said, a lot of heavy it hitters in this game. Know. It's quite oh, anyone's enough. game at this point in time, you know. And then we have Red here. Like coming in number 10. Yeah. Red uh, having OG or gravity on the hills. You know, yeah, uh, I feel like this is the, if I'm not mistaken, this is the only footage I have, or rather, not yeah, even I have, the only footage of action, uh, NG, he not sorry, big, sorry, my bad guys, know, red, red, guns, red, 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 I have here, you know, so, can they make it to the final, I'm not sure, you know, uh, it's, um, it's a no for me, I don't think they can make it, but despite them, you know, having the opportunity of being first blood, but I do believe if, oh, gravity had the opportunity to land earlier, or yeah. same time as them has oh. gotten a good weapon definitely red would have been wiped out because og is just is that much of a, an awesome dude you know you have j j x4 
whatever, 1v4, you know, rushing to secure the kill. Let's see what he's going to oh, do here. Let's see what he's going to do. Here. Look at that. I mean, no, guys. Like, if you're in a tournament and you are in the clear to you know, confirm a kill, you could, you shouldn't yeah, take that long. Like, man, it's taking forever to confirm a knock kill. Can this kind of, you know, uh, Gumpa make it to the finals? I don't think so, literally. And... We have Grim Reapers. Grim Reapers is an amazingly strong guild. Uh, you know, if I'm to make a top 10 guild in the APJ, which I would definitely Grim Reapers will have a place on the guild. You can see Grizzly there with the uh, VSS making sure to secure the kill. And the Grim, actually, an amazing player. The Grim is a very, very powerful player. This man has the power to clutch 1v4 that he is that good. He is that good. You can see uh, GR Burak as well, an OP player coming in there. Oh, they have, oh, yo, guys, look at the squad. Yoro, Burak, Grizzly, the Green. These guys definitely are coming in number six place on the final. Like I said, 12 guys are making it to the final. So far, from our prediction, six guys are in. We have six more spots here. Who do you guys think is going to make it? Like, there's a whole lot of dudes, you know, heavy hitters in this tournament, surprisingly. You know, with insane accuracy, insane strategy. So my camping up for placement points and then getting all the kills at the end of the game and some of fishing up for the kills like your gun smokers and your OPW, you know. So definitely in number six, I believe Grim Report are making it to the finals. As you can see here, they giving nothing to chance. They definitely fishing for the Buyo out here. Look at that guys. With L2 with Lost Army trying to you know counter that. Uh L2K with a Charge Buster, what can he do? What can he do? I mean, he's got his teammate locked down already. Definitely, this is a booyah for Grim Reapers. And there we go. Grim Reapers with a booyah. Like, they are definitely making it to the final. We have Life Fury. Like, these guys are feel like putting a show. Quite an amazing show, you know. Like, I didn't expect so much action from Night Fury, guys. Like, it's just crazy. They are relentless. Always chasing on the enemy. Always sticking together. Making sure they wipe out. You know, NF Gojo, quite an amazing player. NF Kells, like, I, I'm, 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 I'm a very, very um, relentless ranked player. I've seen Kells a lot in ranked rank games, and he's quite good. He is that good. You know, they look, look at that, guys. Look at that, definitely. So, and Night Fury, can they make it to the finals, though? I'm not sure. But then let's say it's a yes or no for me. It's a maybe for me for now. Then we have Serenity. Serenity, you know, taking on team, uh Crimson Met are very much OG good, you know, as we own in our server, but they are actually doing the most strategically waiting, playing the zone battle, and Serenity wipes out CM, guys. Yo, Leo, this is just crazy. Like, the guilds you expect to be doing the most are just, you know, surprising you, and they got these newcomers telling, telling as he said, yes, we can make a name for ourselves, we can do a whole lot, lot, much more if given an opportunity. Look at Serenity wiping out the whole. Grim Reapers, yo, guys, guys, like the prediction is just looking kind of shaky. But if you ask me to Serenity and Night Fury, who would I consider to make it to the final? It's quite, yo, it's a very, very tough one, guys. It's a very, very tough one. But um, I'll put Night Fury in because Night Fury is kind of formidable for us, even though they're new, but they've been around long enough. Like, Serenity is a new good looking game for themselves, and they clutch the Booyah right there. And we have Skyhawks. Sky, like I said, there's a whole lot of newcomers, you know? Trying to say, hey guys, we are, we are, we are quite formidable if given the chance. So what can you know, Nighthawks do? What do they have to say for themselves? Like they come to this tournament, made it to the you know qualifiers, and they're here to the quarterfinals. You know, heading to the finals tomorrow. So do you guys think they're gonna end themselves, end themselves a place in the final? To win the yo, 60,000 diamonds, guys. Like, like yo, okay. this uh, cup actually have brought so much ready? potential and yeah, amazing, yeah, you know, yeah. amazing entertainment so from our server. Look at Sky Harry there. What can he do with his whole teammates? Uh, I think the last of his teammates, so Sky Joy Boy, trying to get to safety, and then Sky Harry is out here trying to prove a point. Let's see, let's see what he can do. Can he clutch the boy right here? Can he clutch the can, can he close the squad wipe? Look at that. And he downs his opponent, guys. Whoa. Look at that, guys. Sky Harry takes out whatever that dude is. You know, and then Sky Adel's Archer with a third party. Why Sky is quite good. And then I believe in this game. Look at it. Took out a whole Ohana squad by themselves. Like, guys, they just might end up in the finals. But then six more spots to go i cannot say for sure if they earn the place in the final or not or yet but i mean like they got a booyah with crazy kills like crazy amount of kills like whoa it's quite surprising look at that 
and they crushed the Buya just like that. She got hard laws. They're quite good. And we have Ohana. Ohana is, is a, you know, it's a very, very formidable game as well with O Lili. Um, yeah, Orage as well, did. kind of make the place in the finals, yeah, just maybe though. Know. I'll, 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 um, I'll put them in a maybe. I mean, looking at this footage whereby the whole squad of Ohana got almost got one by Hina 2, Hina Blast. You're gonna see them pretty much in the next um, analysis. Ah, uh, guys, I'm not sure at this point in time. I mean, if Hina Blast was on low, that was a clean squad wipe, that was a clean clutch. One man took out a whole squad all by himself with this kind of you know gameplay and uh power or force from the team do you think they can survive the gruesome force that's gonna happen tomorrow like a whole lot of entertainment is gonna be taking place tomorrow because now we see dudes that are fighting for the sport in the finals to say yes you are worthy of that sixty thousand diamonds but uh for now i'm gonna put them on probation so we have your instincts, your um, four brothers, your new genesis, your uh, I don't believe that you're the final, your night nice speed, your serenity, and skyhawks, and we have Ohana that are still on a maybe that they could, you know, make it to the final. Uh, yeah, we have Hina, like I said, we have Hina next, Hina 2, which is quite surprising. I'm thinking Hina 1 will actually do the most because I mean, one like the, the, the original is always the better one, right? But Hina 2 actually surprises in this tournament, like almost having a clutch there. Hina blast, how much clutch, clutching the whole of uh, Ohana squad, and you can see there taking together, fighting close range combat. They are very, very good. They are also uh, a good on a brink of rising to this squad. Listen to the footage where Hina 2 takes out a Hina 1. It's quite embarrassing, guys. Like, but I believe Hina 2 has what it takes to make it to the final. They do have the potential to get to the final so definitely the uh, number seven of my team making to the final i'd say hina two you know with uh hina gc getting knocked that hina gc from hina one insane accuracy there but is he gonna clutch with hina ching chong that's what they call him right there and then they take out the whole of hina one and we have my personal favorite team honest like i love fbi guys but with that confirmation bias like this is one of a very very op guild that are quite amazing in tournaments if given the opportunity to play in tournaments but the whole lot of controversial you know um uh, drama and activities surrounding the guild i believe this is quite a, a way to start off you know you know claim their name tell them hey man we still we are fbi we have to be respected you're highly respected like this tournament actually did the most you know strategy playing a whole powerhouse very good in long range fights and short range fights so definitely without much say or do fbi is taking the number eight spots that are going to the finals so we have four more teams out of 24 teams going to the final guys look at our fbi like crush the way like these guys are embarrassingly toxic which is quite good it's entertainment right i mean with no without making it so much of a bad thing like a level of toxicity toxic city oh my god bro english is ripping me guys we have toxic Oh my drama oh my whatever it is is good for the server i mean there is no fun there is no fun in everything be all nice and jolly we can see fba engaging gr here who's gonna take the booyah like fba are uh, already taking out uh ng squad with ng jaden let it survive they're strategically playing it safe waiting and beating their opponent can they take this booyah would they be able to take the booyah i mean it's fba versus grim what was talking about these are two og dudes that are going head on head right now who do you think is gonna win, guys? Like I said, hold on. Oh, look at that beautiful snap from GR and GR Burak is knocked. And GR Burak is knocked. And there we go. We call it securing the kill on Burak. Oh my god, let's go. And oh, and NG still in the battle, right? NG still in the battle. And we losing Robolex to Zone. There we go. NG nudes. Oh, NG Jaden taking the place in position. Can he actually Ted party and get the so kill on them. Can he take party and get? Oh my God, guys! Look at that close range headshot from ACH. Like I told you, this is a power pack dude. Like oh, a whole lot of amazing entertainment for us. Who's gonna take this boy? Oh my God, guys! A close range katana. These guys are crazy. Like FBI are definitely yeah. back and making a name for themselves this is why they are fbi nice. this is why they are respected the definitely making it to the finals like clearing squad like it's nothing all our serenity yeah, squad wiped out and we have fbi again engaging is it gr yes it is gr i mean like they are always hunting oh, grim reapers down look at that is he gonna emote on him oh no oh oh my god guys look at that 
Oh, they're cold at us. Oh, oh, bro. Yo, me, I'll be angry. If he moves to me, I don't care about the fucking drop. I'm gonna hound you. I'm gonna hound you down just to get my kill. Look at that. FBI, who are they fighting now? Who are they fighting now? Who are they fighting now? Let's see what they can do. Can they, can they, can they close this victory? I mean, FBI, of course they can close the victory. Look at, look at this man with the katana. What is he doing? What is he doing? Look at Talib with the katana. Crazy. Definitely FBI on the number seven spot. Is it number seven or number eight? I think it's number eight. So number one, we have XS2, OPW, three OG, four gun smokers, five I slam, six gun repairs, seven Hina 2 8 FBI definitely and we have underrated these guys are quite underrated but actually doing the most but can they make it to the final I mean four sports left which four teams are gonna make it to the final guys it's just insane but they managed to get a beer underrated I mean just because underrated uh just maybe they can make it to the final but like I said between net 3 and serenity will I put I'll put net 3 between underrated and serenity I think I'll put underrated because these guys are crazy these guys are really crazy and then uh just after underrated we have YDZ YDZ is quite a, a very much old respected I would, I would say respected it's a well known dude in our server I mean if you've been in SSA long enough right from the days of EU definitely know that why is it well, the respected dude the and then i haven't really seen them perform much in tournaments or whatever but here they are guys doing the most with why is it or the clutch guys look at that like they've got some new interestingly uh type of name you know kind of football name we have oreo crunchy kicket and who else and who else we have here and and we have snacks wow such a delicious name out here but can they make it to the final as well like i said this is any man's game anyone can take the game but they've been impressively amazing thus far and just maybe they might you know stick together and make their way to the final uh there we go we crunch it down and they take out the last of who so they're performing and here they are and we have um with why does it make it to the final i'm not sure guys it's a little for you now but we have outlaws these are okay it's a beautiful clip from outlaws what can they make it to the final i think not guys like they've just been up and down getting kills where they can but uh, the final material nah Nah, Copy and we have pure skill. You know, like I said, a whole lot of newbies or new goods. When I say we can be a formidable force if given a chance, but looking at pure skill, their gameplay, you know, and strategy and whatever you might call it, I don't think they are final material. But who knows? They might surprise us in the semifinals, which is taking place tomorrow. I mean, guys, it is sixty thousand diamonds on the line. Can they take it? Can they win this? Can they win this? Are they capable? But for my prediction, no. So we have eight teams in. So we have four more teams to go. So in that form, I'll put Natural in taking number nine position. Uh, Skyhawk taking number ten. Uh, Ohana. We have two more. Two more teams. I don't know. I don't know. But why is it actually taking that number eleven position with one more team? Uh, so we are still still chasing the opponent like a prey. Now look at that. Will he get away? Will he survive? Or will he be taken down? Uh, come on, come on, boy. You can do this, boy. Let's go, let's go. Uh, oh my god. That car 98 coming in there to play. And then pure skill. They know showing they have pure skill. And, and number 22, we have Yakuza. Like the name is, you know, Yakuza is more of a, a war oriented or kind of that top buzz. But they are not really performing. Yes, I know Yakuza exists, but then they haven't shown us why they are should be feared as Yakuza in SSA community. So definitely, I do not think they can make it to the final. But like I said, it's any man's game. Anyone can take the team. So 11 teams in, one more team to go. Number one with XS2, OTW3, OG, four Gun Smokers, five Islam, six Grim Reapers, seven Nakiri, eight Serenity, no, it's Skyhawk, nine Ohana, ten FBI. YDZ on number 11 and we have offline guys offline are a formidable dude like I can see PDX right there Melly and not Yaz these guys are very very good in class squad so if those guys are teaming up together you know you definitely will end ending number 12 spot to the tournament so these are my prediction guys these are my 12 finalists that are going to the final I mean they are they're like teamwork is insane accuracy is insane and crazy definitely they do have the potential to make it to the final 
and you have a 24 team with the Corillians. I really didn't see Corillians performing in this tournament. I don't know where they came from. I don't know where they continue to perform. But uh, since because I don't know them or know which team they are coming up with, just maybe they might surprise me. Just maybe they might unknown and not the tournament. So guys, let me know in the comment section which teams or which you do you think are going to the final you can see this is i, I think you've seen this footage earlier whereby uh offline engage with slam eyes but then unfortunately offline lost this battle but nevertheless the quite a formidable force getting the kills and insane damage get himself in the semi-final ready for the final so definitely i believe offline you know is definitely going to the final so thank you guys for watching i know to do like and subscribe to the boy share the stream and <laughs> I'm saying stream guys, yo, definitely I'll be streaming really really soon, so stay tuned to the stream, share the link to my guys, share the video, and let me know in the comment section who stuff you do you think are going to the finals.